The U.S. Coast Guard Quarter Mohawk made its way to the Sierra Leone National Seaport on 30th July this year. The 31-year-old defense naval vessel, which is the youngest of 13 ships of that class, sailed with 100 crew members, including 15 women and 85 men, who are on a scheduled port visit to team up with the maritime sector to enhance coastal security and combating transnational organized crime. The United States Coast Guard has been a leader in uh, maritime law enforcement and marine protection. And so we are very eager to exercise our existing partnership with Sierra Leone. What's specific in the area of fishing is that we are working to help Sierra Leone manage its fishery and to prevent other countries from uh, conducting illegal, unregulated, unregulated or unreported fishing. Uh, we recognize that it's not just about uh, taking fish that you shouldn't be taking, but it's also about transferring them at sea, and not providing the host country with any knowledge of their, the status of their fish stock. During a comprehensive tour on the U.S. naval vessel, the Vice President, Dr. Mohamed Julda Jallo, affirms the interaction, training and experience sharing between the Coast Guards and the Maritime Security Wing will lift the sector with the essential knowledge and modern techniques needed to better control the coast as he explains the economic challenges preventing the country to benefit from marine resources. One of the major challenges we have been facing with is to develop the capability to police the coast because we don't know what is happening in the coast. Sierra Leone is blessed with a lot of marine resources but because we don't have the capability to police the coast, we don't get the benefit that is required from those marine resources. And one area that we want to expand revenue generation it's marine product, but all what we get as a government from marine product is licensing of boats because packaging and exportation of marine product is not done here. Most times it is done on the high seas. The United States Coast Guard protects both domestic and international water routes. The U.S. Ambassador to Sierra Leone, David Reimer, emphasized the two countries have a solid bilateral relationship, citing the visit is a substantial indication of that strength and cooperation. The U.S. Coast Guard has been involved in protecting the coastline of the United States since 1790. They've done a, they do a lot of work with uh, search and rescue if someone is in trouble. Uh, they protect our shores from uh, drugs entering the shore and from uh, illegal fishing. So that's their expertise and they have come here to share that expertise with Sierra Leone and to help Sierra Leone with the, with the very things that the Vice President was talking about. The team will be in Sierra Leone for a few days and... In addition to the counter-narcotic mission, the Mohawk vessel also helped in tackling illegal migration. Sally Fucherno Kamara, AYV News.